Hi guys, Mia Mab here and welcome back to my channel. So today I will be showing you how to remove your hair color using bleach wash. Wherein we will be mixing bleach, developer, shampoo or conditioner, and water. So we can remove your hair color, turning it from this, wherein it's already fading, to this. Alright, as you can see, the grown out hair was not affected at all. And that's great because I've already tried it out on my hair first, doing the lower half, uh, doing a halo section on it. And then since it actually worked, I'm going to be doing my whole head, removing every hair color on it, making it yellow, just like before, after bleaching. We'll be toning it and then we'll be coloring it again. All right. And if you'd like to know how I did that, then keep on watching. All right, so we'll be needing bleach. Any powdered bleach will do. And since I only have here a 30% developer, I'm gonna use that, but you can definitely use 20 to 30 because we'll just be removing the hair color, a bowl, and of course, our conditioner. Um, I'm using this keratin shampoo or any regular shampoo, regular conditioner, or keratin or hot oil will also do. And then this brush, so we can use it to mix everything up. And of course, water, okay? So first thing that we're going to do is, I'm just eyeballing everything. Oh, sorry. And I'm just going to be putting in equal portions of everything. Mm. Yep, I think that's enough. Putting in our developer. Oh. Mm, yep, I think that's enough. Our shampoo, because I ran out of shampoo, so this is what I'm using. Mm, yeah, I think I, I would be needing to use two of these. I used conditioner on the lower half of my hair, but now we're going to try to use shampoo if it's, you know, going to work the same. It's, if it's going to work as good as the conditioner. Just that. And then, if this is around equal parts, I'm going to be putting in the like half part water. Mm, yep, I think that's good. And we'll just be mixing this all up. Alright, now I'm ready. Garbage bag. And we're going to start. turning blonde so looks like it really even shampoo or conditioner like any regular shampoo or conditioner would work on this now we're gonna get back Oh, 
and this is the last of it. And we're out. Now, Just gonna be removing the gloves. Do not touch the bleach. It's gonna hurt your hands. And we'll be using the same garbage bag to cover our head with. use our magnetic clip to hold this in place and we're just gonna leave this on for five minutes and then rinse it and then I'll be back see you so I've already rinsed it and dried it out it is very yellow indeed but what I love about it is how easy you can even out your hair color <laughs> Not that easy, apparently. So I'm just gonna retouch these parts. I don't know where the, why there's a patch in there. And the roots remain the same. Hmm. It's pretty even in the back. <laughs> so from this part, in this patch, it's literally a uh, I'm just going to I don't know I'm thinking if I'm gonna do it again on those parts or I'm just gonna let it be and anyway, I'm just gonna be coloring this um, purple and blue so I'm just gonna let it rest like this and you know leave it this way for about 24 hours before I tone it and then before coloring it you know just giving it time to breathe so it's super yellow, like super cyan yellow. Like. Yeah. Uh, let's see what it looks like um, in natural light. Brassy, yellow, lighter than it actually is compared to when there's a ring light. Hmm. Pretty happy with it though. Apart from the patch. But it's okay. Not mad.
so apparently blue plus yellow is equivalent to green and it did not turn out as I planned it to be to be blue and purple but it turned out like this that's purple and then blue green not blue blue but more of a blue green it's not that even there's no hints of yellow in it the top part though is pretty cool I mean I should have toned it and bleached it one more time for around 30 to 45 minutes more but you know I'm not mad at it I think it looks cute I mean not me the hair color I mean not bad well definitely not perfect but not that bad well if I say so myself and that's pretty much it our super saiyan slash our super saiyan turned into mermaid hair um got most of the back yeah. most of it mm. there are really really hard to reach areas it's like stripes vertical stripes you see the other side sense of yellow <laughs> an inch more <laughs> around my forehead my new dad forehead and was this what I planned no do I hate it no do I love it kind of yeah actually I do just needs a better execution, more bleach, more toning, definitely. So the color would pop out more, but definitely not mad in. I'm loving it. So hope you like it. And if you did like it, enjoyed it, or at least learned something from it, please do not forget to hit on the like button, subscribe to my channel, and turn on your notification bell so you will be the first to know the moment I upload a new video. And if you have any comments, questions on what we did, or suggestions on what videos you want me to do next, please feel free to put them all down below or hit me up on Instagram, and it's me. Mav Mav. You now have a good one. I'll see you in our next video. Bye-bye.